Hello, um, today's story time is coming from the Tech Crew and we're going to read a little bit from Horses, Divorces and Hissy Fits which is a story about a girl who grows up in the city and um, her mother moves to uh, a derelict house in the country uh, where they're having to live in a caravan in a field with no Wi-Fi and no mobile reception while the house is being done up. So let's have a little go and read this. Imagine a remote country retreat set down a long leafy lane in a charming oldie worldy cottage with roses around the door and lupins and hollyhocks in the garden. Not. Truth is, we're living in a building site. The air is thick with dust of centuries old plaster, dirt, rotting wood and a zillion corpses of every creature from flies to woodworms. This noxious fug is destroying our lungs, clogging our pores and probably laying down the foundations of a painfully slow death later in life. My mother is seriously deranged. She waltzes around, shouting, Isn't this fantastic? It's a dream come true. Oh, please. Normal people have flaws. We have holes. We have piles of wood, heaps of rubbish, bags of cement and um, plaster, and an assortment of lethal and sharp, dangerous tools. Every step we take is part of an obstacle course of life-threatening proportions. If we don't die of suffocation in some deep, stagnant pit we've fallen into, we'll die of twitching, hair-raising electrocution because we don't have the right spotlights. You can always go in a caravan, she shrugs. I up the odd, throw my worst tantrum ever, sulk for longer, shout, and even risk the odd spit of swearing. No, she's obliviously happy, deliriously joyful. Nothing shall spoil her excitement.